Where is it? Ugh. Oh, come on. Where's that note? <sighs> right. <sighs> Let's see. Um. So, what's up with all this mess, huh? I'm just looking for one important note. Yeah, and you had to make a mess on the table for that? <sighs> what's this weird piece of paper? <gasps> oh! There it is. I need to check quickly. No, but what about Susie? Ah, <sighs> uh, yes. So, uh -huh. what's this? I haven't seen such things in our house before. I bought it in a vending machine at the library. I had to eat something for lunch. I had little time. <sighs> a real vending machine? Uh -huh. Oh, I only know cardboard ones. If we make here. Sue, uh, Sue, I know these machines give out the items, but uh, uh, how do they sort the coins, huh? Uh, uh, Sam! Uh, oh, I know. There are little people inside. They take the coins and they give the items, right? What? Oh, like uh, in the Men in Black movie? I remember that, sure, but vending machines don't work like that. Then how? Well, you already saw how a machine gives out candies and chocolates, even soda. So, I only need to show you how such machines sort coins. Come! Yay! We're going to learn something new again! Hi, guys! Today, we're going to make a coin sorting machine. From metal? Uh, no. From plastic? No, Sammy, from cardboard. But a real vending machine isn't made of cardboard. Yes, sure, but it's not that important to understand how it works. Uh, well, fine, I can agree with that. Are you gonna help me? I need to think on that. Oh, <laughs> well, all right, think. What are you making now? I'm making a pass system for the coins so that each coin will fall into a certain compartment. Look, this will be the first phase. To make sure the coins pass one by one. I need to measure here. Huh. Yes. <laughs> See? Two coins won't pass. I can see that. Continue. Sammy, at least select three coins for me. 25, 5, and 1 cent. Yes! I'm going to need them now. And I'll set this piece aside. Hey, Sammy, where are the coins? Here they are! Now I understand why they need to be sorted. It's hard to find the one you need. Phew! That's right. Now, can you imagine how many coins a vending machine in a crowded place processes in a day? For example, in a library or in the subway? You can't do it without automation. So, it's better to do some work once, and then it goes smoothly afterwards. Look, each coin will have its own little window, and they will fall into their own little compartments. Perfect. Little windows? Oh, make them with your signature trick. Well, all right, and hop! Voila! Now let's glue the side walls to make sure the coins don't roll away. <laughs> I still don't get it. How will it work? Here, look, see? Only the coins of a suitable size can fall into the opening. Oh, now I'm starting to get it! Yes, awesome! Well, all right, Sue. I understand how the coins will be sorted, but, uh, how will they get into the coin tunnel? We won't push them with our hands, right? Oh, no, no, Sammy. The motor will help us with that. We're going to connect it to the battery with the help of wires. Guys, be very careful with the wires. You'd better ask an adult to help you with this stage. And to make sure we can turn the motor on and off, we'll connect this switch to it. Right, this wire goes here and that one there. Done! Now we only need to glue a small screw to the motor to create the effect we need. There. 
What effect? A vibration effect. Look! Oh! <laughs> it's jumping wild! So, will this help the coins get into the sorting tunnel? <laughs> That's right. Let's hide our mechanism into a cardboard case to keep it safe from damage. We'll glue the motor here. Carefully. Watch out for the wires. And the battery goes here. And walls all around. Yes, Sammy. Thanks. Huh. And you've been saying that I'm not helping you. You had a piece with a hole in it. I removed it as a faulty one. Oh, no, Sammy. It should have a hole. It's for the switch. So please don't throw that piece away. Here. Um, look. It fits perfectly. Like this. And we'll cover it carefully. Okay, done. Sue, Sue, this has to be the trash, right? Weird pieces, leftovers, I guess. Sam, Sam, wait. No, these are very important. We need to set our case with the motor on these legs to allow the coins to fall down. See? Oh, uh, well, I'm just out of shape. Confusing trash with parts. Oh. Cheer up, Sammy, and bring the rest of the pieces, all right? But don't throw anything away. Will do! And we have made this structure. We only need to add the walls. Cardboard pieces delivery! Oh, wonderful, Sam! Now we're going to make the finishing piece. Which piece? Well, the containers where the coins will fall in. Vending machines store all the coins separately to give out the change very quickly. Oh, I see. Tell me, Susie, do all vending machines sort coins by size? Well, that's the basic principle. But modern machines can distinguish coins according to the metals in them and even the images on them to exclude any errors. But our sorting machine is a very basic one. So it'll sort coins only according to its size. <laughs> oh, but it's still really awesome! Oh, Sammy, could you bring me the stickers for our containers? Just a moment! And I'll connect our sorting mechanism. I'll be quick. Ta-da! It's not ta-da without decor. You know that. Oh. Move aside. Make room for the professional decorator. Sammy, maybe I should do it. You know, neatly. Well, fine. I did a lot today already. All right. 50 cents. 25. 10. And 1 cent. And on off for the switch. Is it ta-da now? Yes! Ta-da! <laughs> Start the machine! Let's place several handfuls of coins in here. Perfect. And click. Oh, they flow like a river. Oh, yeah. Look, look. They're sorted correctly. That's awesome. Now all the coins in the house will be sorted out perfectly. Will you keep it under control? Yes, ma'am. Will do, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> well done. Guys, was it interesting for you to learn how coin sorting happens? Give a thumbs up if it was. And subscribe to the channel to learn more interesting facts about our world. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.